Mike Rogers, congratulations with your win here in Minsk. At 100 meter, you won. How do you feel? I felt pretty good. Uh, pretty easy run. Like a false start kind of delayed the race. I think it messed up the fast times in the race, but it was a big head win. So 10.20 to a negative 1.1, I'll take it, and I'm happy. A pretty easy run. Is that why you did the 400 meter celebration lap? Yeah, I did that, but it, it paid for it. These spikes hurt my feet, so I had to take them off. They felt like a woman in heels, so I had to get them off my feet. What, what were your thoughts when you got the invitation to come here to Minsk for, for a match, Europe versus US? Well, I always love coming to this part of the country. The fans are good. Uh, they love track and field. I know they have great facilities and first class uh, hospitality, so I love coming here. Let's go back to 2007. Uh, it was a major, well, very important year for you. You were eating a hot dog, and what happened? Hey, I became a pro athlete, got a good coach, became fast, and it changed my life. Because what was going on at that point? Oh, I was working at a shoe store, uh, selling shoes on my truck, a manager at Foot Locker. So track and field wasn't my main priority. I was playing basketball as well, so I ended up making track my main job. You were on the point that you were about to quit athletics. Uh, but wh why did that coach come, came to you? He felt like he had faith in me, and I thank my coach, Daryl Wilson, to this day for the luxurious career I'd have with Nike and on the track. And uh, he has been your coach ever since? Coach the whole time, so thanks, D2. And what is he learning you still? I'm um, just trying to get me to perfect my race, perfect my craft. Uh, I haven't been running track all my life like a lot of athletes, so I feel like I'm just coming into my prime, and it's showing right now. What's still on the list to do? I got a medal at Doha. Medal at the Olympics next year, list will be complete. Last question, what's the spirit in the team? You said what? What's the spirit now in the team? Ah, uh, the spirit is very, very high. We wish Isaiah would have ran, but we took care of business. Now on for the 4x1 later on tonight.